Hi everyone, in this video we are going to talk about overriding. The main concept of overriding is that we have two functions with the same name and the same parameter, but one in the super class or the parent class, while the other one in the second class or the child class. Look at that. You cannot use overriding without inheritance because the overriding is how can that function, which is in the subclass, override the functionality of the function in the superclass. For example, let's suppose that we have a class called A. This class A has a function called show. This function print the keyword a now we have another function which called b this b extends from a why it give error as we have talked in the previous video you should use the keyword open to allow inheritance now i have declared another function in the subclass with the same name show but this function print line b this is called overriding so what is overriding two functions with the same name but one in the super class or the parent class while the other in the child class or the subclass now why it give error because all the function in kotlin cannot be overrided because they are final by default the same as classes so you should use the keyword open here and you should use the keyword override in the subclass. So to implement the overriding concept in Kotlin, use the open in the parent class and use the override keyword in the subclass. Now, if we go to the main function with default array, And I've tried to create two objects, one called A from the class A and A.show, while another one B small from the class B capital, and also we try to call the B.show. So I have created two objects, one from the A class and another one from the second class. Let's try this example. Yes, as you see here, a from a.show and b from b.show. So in this video, we have talked about how can we implement the concept of overriding using the Kotlin programming language. See you in the next